It's an issue that's quickly going to impact on all sectors of the economy, but particularly agriculture. And in agriculture's case, it's a particularly complex issue because farms are both sources of emissions and sources of sequestration of carbon dioxide. So getting the policy right, getting the understanding right is going to be quite difficult. And it really is important that leaders and agribusiness uh, leaders uh, understand the issue quite well while the policies are still being developed. This conference is very specific to the impacts on the agriculture sector of climate change policy. It brings together leading scientists uh, from Australia and New Zealand who are dealing with issues like soil carbon. It also brings together um, consultants and economists dealing with issues like um, carbon sink forestry development and what that might mean. And it also brings in very senior policy makers from Commonwealth government departments. So it's a very direct opportunity to, uh, to engage right with the people who are making decisions and to make sure they understand the issue from a farm or an agribusiness concept. The conference covers uh, everything from the science, so a lot of discussion about uh, agricultural emissions and how they're calculated. Um, things like soil carbon, what is feasible, what isn't, what it would mean for farmers to undertake uh, soil carbon offsets. Carbon sink forestry will be discussed in detail with a number of uh, consultants and policy people. Um, we've also got leading um, farmers from the USA and New Zealand who are going to explain in great detail uh, what the policies are that will be operable in their countries. We also have a panel session of farm leaders um, who are going to try and collectively come up with some ideas on how the agriculture sector should progress. So it, it really is uh, the prime forum for discussion of agriculture and greenhouse emission issues in Australia. Well, this is an issue that is going to impact on all businesses, be they farm businesses or agribusiness, and getting a good understanding of the implications of that is very important. There's a lot of misinformation, a lot of glib comments made by people who have a perhaps superficial understanding of, of some of the issues, and I think farmers could easily be led into um, uh, believing some things that, that probably uh, are not appropriate. So uh, I think it really is important, particularly for farmers, but also for their service providers, agribusiness uh, leaders, etc., to make sure they really do understand what this issue is all about.